Hello and welcome to 1152 Premont, a house built in 94 that in the last few months I've made a ton of improvements upon and I'm going to show you what they are so you know exactly what you're getting before even showing up. So this beautiful little deck area was just repainted. I put in flower beds. Uh, they've gotten a little too much water recently. Um, installed an outdoor plug. Uh, the grass is a little long, and yes, I need to take out that trash, but these are all things, of course, that will be done before you move in. Um, there is a couple pieces of furniture left by the previous renters. Um, I'm happy to remove those for you, or you can um, use them, either one. Uh, we've got a newer carpet and a brand new professionally laid hardwood floor in the kitchen. Brand new appliances that are just, well, I'd say a couple weeks old. We got the wash, um, dishwasher. We've got under, under the covered, under the counter lights here and there. And all of the cabinetry is new and or has been recently finished. And we've got a little uh, pull out cabinet that is also quite new, new stove, new um, microwave. We have a laundry room that has a, well, apparently I need to fix that light, but um, otherwise a uh, good quality washer and dryer. They're not new, but they were very expensive and are at the time and they're in a good shape. A brand new $2,500 uh, furnace so you know that your heating is going to be very efficient and very affordable. I should have started off with the best. The best this house has to offer isn't quite this master bedroom which is very nice, has a nice window and a walk-in closet that if you can't fit all your clothes in here maybe you've got too many clothes so we've got the top shelf all the hanging area storage there's a brand new hot water heater behind those panels so again very efficient your utilities will be very low the master bedroom has its own private bathroom brand new giant mirror lights um, toilet just a normal toilet but we have its brand new finished shower with the easy to use handle and um, you know it's got its private light and you know it's easily easily can fit two people in here so that's I mean this house is so much better than my own house um, and so that's the master bedroom and we have a second bedroom I will fix those little um, uh, marks on the wall they weren't there before but obviously when someone moved out they weren't super gentle um, and uh, newly painted newly refinished closet right there and we have a coat closet over here all freshly repainted and shelves and everything were just installed and then we have the the regular house bathroom with one of those deluxe low flow toilets and everything and you know window with the shower all nice and beautiful new uh, mirror there medicine cabinet then we have the third bedroom another nice recently refinished closet some more furniture that you can take it or leave it i will be happy to get rid of it for you i just don't want to get rid of it if i think there's a chance you may want to use it and then we have a door um, the third door to the house goes right out to the backyard yes i definitely need to mow it i'm in fact don't mind mowing your yard for you if you don't have a lawnmower. Um, I'm about to put up a big shed right over there. And um, so it's a good size fenced in yard. Great for kids and pets and, you know, another little mini deck here. And uh, that is the house. So um, not the best video, but at least you have a pretty good idea of what to expect with this house. My favorite feature not only is the uh, private bathroom in the master but I love the open floor plan living room kitchen oh and that's a really nice uh, ceiling fan that you know has many different modes and really helps with the circulation of air and you know not that the central air isn't great but um, you know save money by just using the ceiling fan or having the two in conjunction with each other hope you like it